a UFC featherweight division fight. All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is gonna be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oh, head kick blocked by Tavares. Connects with a right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. That one appeared to stun him. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here, and they separate. Oh, and he caught the kick. Leg kick. Under a minute now to go round one. Nice strike. Oh, man, another nice leg kick is there. Just missed with the left there. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. He's beating his leg up. Tavares' shot there is blocked. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Right now, we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides, really. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, here we go with round two. All right, under three minutes now to go in round two. Oh, well, that's a good strike there by Tavares. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working. Oh, that is a huge shot there, DC. I'm not sure how he stayed upright. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Lee gets caught with that punch. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, I love the jab. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fight. Good jab. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Lee's shot is blocked. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Final seconds here of round two. Ooh, big knee. What a round. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result.
Third round underway. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there. Really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. There's no tell on that leg kick. Well, that'll work. Counter jab to the head by Lee. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Under two minutes to go in round three. Nice. Some nice back and forth action here. Tavares has got a bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. Oh, shot to the body connects there. He hasn't really thrown too many body strikes in this fight, but now as this fight goes on, he is not discriminating, working the body, and those shots are going to count. Oh, nice right hand. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Lee. Oh, man, how is he standing? Brutal knee to the body. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, collar tie. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Going out of the body with that hook. Well done there by Lee. Another shot lands upstairs. So a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's your replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well. But when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal. And if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. Three minutes now to go in this one. Oh, that is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, big head kick there. That is, oh, man, this dude is good. That's a big strike right there. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. Oh, liver shot right on the leg. Liver shot, that is the most debilitating shot in all of fighting. It is very difficult to recover from that. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. What a punch. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, Always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. 20 minutes in the books. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Get on his 
bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Caught the kick. And they separate. And he is dealing with a cut, it looks like, above that right eyebrow. It's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Under two minutes remain in the fight. Got the single collar tie. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Nice punch here. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence, and when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. It's either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Back and forth we go here. That's as good a punch as he's thrown all night. The punch that lands down the middle, the one that you don't feel, is the ones that land perfect, and that one landed perfectly. Single collar tie now. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. What else can you say but what a fight? Boom, body kick right there, landed perfect. Looks like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buffett. 